How I got my name and how I got started. Just used to come here every day by myself. And then Kenny just spoke to me one day and he was like, who are you? Nobody gonna be better than me. Like before they were saying, who's that running on the court? Why he's running on the court? Now the energy changed. Ten years later, eleven years later, I'm forever grateful for that. I'm forever grateful for the opportunity to be in Dykeman for life. I'm part of Dykeman basketball. We just combine that energy, like we just we united basketball with the community. That's what Dykeman did, and I just I don't know. I'm a part of it now forever. Dream basketball, big chucks. Welcome to Dream Basketball, shout out Dream Basketball. You're now rocking with Heckler. One of the most electrifying, energetic hype men in street ball. I'm gonna tell y'all a couple of things about myself, you know, so just take a walk with me. I say what's on my mind and how I feel. Nobody gonna be better than me, I'm the best. Just growing up, me, me as a kid, just growing up, being from Brooklyn and from New York City, like, I was always in the atmosphere of basketball and like, sports period you know so growing up my aunts my family you know they from over here like and i always used to pass on a train and i used to see dykeman used to always say like what is it what's dykeman basketball and i used to watch off the train every day every time i took the train so me coming over here it was just i wanted to see what it was about once i actually got put on a dykeman about I say 20, 2008, 2009, I came over here. My mother moved over there. Told me I might show, pull up, beep, the road. And my mother, my mother just moved to Dykeman and I seen the atmosphere, I seen the environment. I was so used to this and I loved it. And it was basketball. I grew up around all the basketball players, Sebastian Telfair, Stephon Marbury, like I'm right there, I'm from that era in Coney Island. So just being around basketball since a kid and then seeing it, it's like I wanted to be a part of it. So found my way to make it on the court. Stood under the basket a couple games, rooting against people, rooting for people. And like it just made me who I am now. And like I'm the biggest hype man in the world. Like I could go from zero to a hundred real quick. It's just that simple. Like being around being around basketball, the, the energy is different. Like me, I used to see it on the train. And I used to always watch. But I'd never seen the energy that Dykeman got now. I never seen like I never seen the energy Dykeman has now, like running on the court. People doing backflips, begging me to heckle people. Like I'm I'm getting asked this. Like they begging me to do that. They asking where I am, they asking where I'm at now. Like before they were saying who's that running on the court, why he's running on the court. Now the energy changed, the environment. We a family, we a community now. So we just I don't know, I don't even <clears throat> I don't even know how to say it. We just combine that energy like we just we united basketball with the community. That's what Dykeman did. And I just, I don't know, I'm a part of it now forever. How I got my name and how I got started, just being a part of Dykeman, I just used to come here every day by myself. And then Kenny yo, yo, yo. He just spoke to me one day and he was like, who are you? And I was like, I'm Heckler, like that's what I do. I say what's on my mind and how I feel because I love the game of basketball. And he was like, oh, we had a Heckler before. I said, but I'm the best and there's not gonna be nobody better than me. And then he just gave me the opportunity to enjoy every game, front row, on the court. Right there. And he gave me the opportunity to be next to these superstars, these celebrities. It's like, I'm, I'm forever grateful for that. I'm forever grateful for the opportunity to be in Dykeman for life. I'm part of Dykeman basketball. Dream basketball. Big checks. We started branding, you know what I mean? We, we started to reach out. 
This is all we have over here. Some of these kids would never even play on another court. What's up, my boy? I wanna put on for every kid in the world who wanna be just like me, who wanna have the energy, who wanna have the drive to help to help their kids, who wanna have the drive to help their friends be better in life and be better in sports, basketball, baseball, anything you want to do. So my impact on basketball and Dykeman is just to have these kids on the right path and remain focused. Like, I started up there. Every, every time he pop out his leg, that's no lie. That's a lifestyle, no turn me up. That's real. That's no lie. In every event, I see this man every the voice of the trenches out right now. Go get that, you don't got to. You don't got to be coming to get you. Then I was right here. Now I'm all over. Dream basketball. You never know what could happen. Dreams don't come true without the actions. Feel me?